hello guys and welcome back to the geo special so in this tutorial we are going to learn about clipping by source layer so this will be a fairly easy process as i'll show you so in order to clip a layer using ogr to ogr you will need to uh, use the clip src um, parameter or argument followed by the source layer which can be a shape file and then the output layer and then the input layer which contains the features you want to be clipped out so you can either use clip src or clip dst and the difference is that clip src is generally used to clip this kind of layers directly or in straightforward but when using clip dst it's mainly used to clip after reprojecting a file According to OGR to OGR docs, we can see that there are various ways to clip um, layers and I'm just showing you an example. You can try out the rest and play. So this is QGIS um, desktop and I have opened up a number of files. One shows the random points that I generated using random geojson which is a tool that I created for generating random points, lines, or polygons within a user-defined extent. So we also have the Marsabit boundary. So Marsabit is a county in Kenya. And what you're going to be doing is you're going to clip out the uh, points within Marsabit county, not using QGIS, but using OGR to OGR. So first, in order to do that, we need to call OGR to OGR and then use the clip src next you are going to define the source file which in my case is stored in it's stored in marsabit stroke marsabit.shp and then now the output file We'll just call it clip clip by source dot shp and then um, the input file which are the random points so it's under random stroke random points dot shp now if you open up output folder we can just drag one of these files that has been created into QGIS. Now as you can see the green points that are highlighted have been clipped uh, within Marsabit County. You can zoom to the layer. And these points are the only points that fall within the boundaries of Marsabit County. Join me in the next tutorial where we clip by extent rather than using a source file. And guys. If these tutorials are helpful to you in any way, consider subscribing to my channel and don't forget to give this video a like. Bye.